According to former Deputy Prime Minister and leader of the People's Action Movement, Sean Richards, his diplomatic passport was deactivated while he was away in the United States, but a recent press release from the Ministry of National Security denies this is the case. Richards commented on the matter while speaking at the opening of the PAM Constituency No. 2 office for Central Bastille on 13th May 2022 as the party prepares for early general elections on St. Kitts and Nevis. I'm a sensible man, you know. I have a U.S. visa. And I always say to people, I ain't applying for no visa in a diplomatic passport. Because nobody gonna take back the diplomatic passport and when they take it back, they take back the visa with it. Where's well, a good thing I do that? So, the visa in the next passport, the morning when I got to the airport, I give them the diplomatic passport. I say, Mr. Mina, I think this year works still, you know. <laughs> I don't think he works still. But swipe it, they tell me what he say. When the man don't swipe it, he watch it. He watch the system. He say, let me go and call my supervisor. <laughs> I said, no, you're not going to call a supervisor. I say, why it is happen? He said, I've never seen this message before. <laughs> This passport is no longer federally eligible to travel on. I say here, you use this passport, you okay? And I gave him the regular passport. Because maybe they thought I would have been stuck in the US. But I'm smarter than them. I'm smarter than them. And it is only a matter of time before I return to office as the next Prime Minister of this country. The following day, 14th May, the Ministry of National Security that is responsible for issuing and recalling passport issued a press release. It refuted Richard's statement. It reads in part, quote, The Ministry of National Security hereby informs the general public that none of the diplomatic passports of the six former ministers of government have been deactivated by the ministry. Neither has any passport of a former minister been barred by the ministry from being used for international travel. End quote. The six ministers of government from PAM and CCM had their ministerial portfolios revoked after they had informed the Governor General they no longer supported Dr. Timothy Harris as Prime Minister. The six also lodged a motion of no confidence against Harris with the Speaker of the National Assembly. Harris dissolved Parliament before the motion was heard. Glenn Bart reporting for SK Newsline.